Hi guys, it's Paige at Cover Books, and I started. I decided to start filming my in my mailbox early because I got two packages today, and I wanted to unbox them. And I think that for the rest of this week, I'm just gonna do an unboxing. Every time I get a package, I'm just gonna add it onto this one with an unboxing and put it all together for an in my mailbox. Because most of, most of the times when I get a lot of books during the week, I'm like, wait, what did I get? And I forget. I should probably put them in the same spot, but they get moved around a lot, and then I forget. So anyways, I got two packages today, and I'm going to unbox them for you. The mailman wasn't very nice, because look at this package. I'm not exactly excited about that, but it seems like a small book, so it doesn't seem like anything's touching it, but usually the post office is better than that, but who knows. Let's see what this is. Oh, it's hooked. By, oops, look, hooked by Liz Bichera, and if you guys, I, I got this from, um, well, I must have gotten it from these people, but every week on Sundays, which I actually missed last night, but that's okay because I got two, I picked two books this week anyway, so I couldn't do it, uh, I picked two books last week anyway, so I couldn't do it again this week, but every week on Sunday around six-ish, um, Arc Cycling, um, I can't remember who runs it. I'll leave all the links below. But Arc Cycling does this art thing where they, she like rounds up all the books that people don't want anymore and then she puts them on this list. And you have to go fill out the form as fast as you can to say, tell her what books you want if you want to get them. Because if you don't do it fast, somebody's going to take them. And then you don't get them. So I did it fast and I ended up getting this book, which I'm excited about because I really wanted this. And then I got it. This must be this bookmark. Either this is the donators or this is just a random swag. But it says the book monsters feed us more. This is really cute. And then there's all the information on the back. So yeah, th it's supposed there's supposed to be arcs because it's arc cycling. But I this this doesn't look like an arc, which is cool. It just looks like a paper pack, which is cool. I'm excited. Okay, so that's the first thing I got. It's the second one. This is the second book. And I already know what it is because I looked at the center. <laughs> I recently read um, her first book. So the mailman is so not being nice to me today. Look at these packages. Like, really? Because I remember I sent a package out last week and I watched the person who got it unbox her package. And it didn't look as good as it did when I sent it out. And I was like, what the heck? But anyways, um... Where is the... Okay. So, anyways... This person sent this to me. I recently reviewed her, well, not recently, probably back in the school year of 2013, which is pretty recent, but I reviewed her first book, The Blood and the Children, and I really, really liked it. So she rec she asked me if I wanted to review the second book in that series, and I was like, definitely, I want to know what happens. So she's like, cool, she's like, I'll send it to you, the bubble wrap. She's like, that's cool, I'll send it to you. See, now, why can't everybody be like, Megan Joel Peterson and wrap up their books in saran wrap and bu bubble wrap so that their books don't get um, ruined. Because, like, look, this is all in bubble wrap, so it would not get ruined. I'm probably going to ruin it trying to open it, but, you know, at least the mailman didn't ruin it. So, yeah, I got Talison Ascendant by Megan Joel Peterson, book two of The Children in the Blood. And she signed it. I love her signature. They're so neat. Like, it looks like it's a part of the book, but it's not. It's so neat. But the first book has a signature like that, too. And I love it. This one looks like it's a lot bigger than the first one, which is fine, because the story. Um, it, the story is about a girl who, she lives alone with her dad and her sister and two other people that are, like, I, they're not really related, but, I mean, if they fit, they fit in her life as, like, grandparents. But, um, and then one night, things happen and her dad gets murdered or whatever and her sister gets taken away from her because they have powers and people they, the people that are like taking over her farm whatever know they have powers so she has to get her sister away but her sister what so they get in this getaway car with this guy this is all the first book and they get away and then all of a sudden the guy swerves off path because someone was chasing them and crashes and so they all stumble out of the car, and the two, the guy and the sister, the little sister, fall over a cliff, and, which is not a spoiler, because you'll see what happens in the book, and, um, 
the other sister gets away and she has to like she she just runs first she she focuses on getting away from the bad guys and then she has to focus on getting her sister back um so it was a really good book and i'm excited to see what happens in book two i like the cover it's pretty interesting the other cover i think was just like a brick wall so it was kind of boring but this one has fire whoa fire so anyways yeah that's everything I got this week, guys. Well, no, that's not everything I got this week. It's only Monday. Who knows what I'll get there the rest of the week. <laughs> but thanks for watching. Bye. Hey, guys. It's Paige, and I quickly wanted to show you, because I said I'd be adding on to the in my mailbox as the week goes on t f with more books I got. And I know I, bis I said I was going to be doing unboxing, and I still am. I just don't have to unbox this one because I bought it at the store. So I wanted to quickly share this one with you so I could put it away. Because um, so, I know if I put it away now, I'll forget that I bought it, and then I'll be like, what? Oops, I forgot. But anyways, I went to Target with my mom recently, and I came and she owed me a little bit of money. So I was like, Mom, just how about you just buy me this book, and then the debt will be over. And she's like, Okay, whatever. So I decided I looked through the I looked through the Target section of books a little bit, and they have quite a bit of books that I wanted, which was cool. But I ended up getting um more of an adult fiction one, because the adult fictions at Barnes and Noble are so freaking expensive. Like, a Barnes & Noble, this would have been, this little paperback book would have been $15. It's like, that's ridiculous. But anyways, that's why I grabbed it at Target, because it was like $11, and then it was 20% off, so. That was good. This is When, uh, no, no, yeah, When in Doubt Add Butter by Beth Harbison. So, I'm excited, because this has been on my wish list for a long time. Ever since I saw it, I put it on my wish list, and I was like, I want that. And then I finally, I like, I saw it at Target yesterday, and I was like, oh, look how beautiful. And it was the cheapest one out of all the adult books. It was the cheapest, so I grabbed it. I snatched it up. I love this cover. It's so cute, and the little cupcakes. It's just so cute. And it's about a chef. I picked up this one, and I picked up one other book by that I had also had on my wish list, and this one was about a chef, and the other one was about, like, a, like a, a lawyer or something, and I was like, I'm gonna go with the chef one. <laughs> Because I like cooking, so I thought I figured the chef one would be a lot more interesting. So yeah, this is the only thing that I got today. Uh, and tomorrow, I don't know. Actually, I didn't even get this today, because I'm filming this on Tuesday. And I got this, I actually got this the same day that I showed you my other books. But, um, I don't know. So I didn't get anything else today other than I got this yesterday. And I don't know, we'll see. But I'm adding on to this, and it's already a two-minute video, so that's just awful. Thanks for watching, guys. Hey, guys, it's Paige at Cumber Books, and I'm adding on to uh, my In My Mailbox again because I got a package. I already opened it because when I got it, I was like, oh, this is such a weird box. What did I get? And I totally forgot about saying that I was going to unbox everything on camera, so I just ripped it open. I was like, oh, I, I don't understand what this is. But I put it back in the box to make it seem like it's unboxing. See, it's open. Okay, now I'm going to show you what I got. <laughs> okay, so I recently won a giveaway. Oh, crap. I meant to go look up her YouTube channel before I did this video. Um, But I'll leave her YouTube channel below. I know her name is Sarah, but I can't remember her YouTube channel name. Because I forgot to look it up. I meant to do that, but I forgot. But anyways, I'll leave, uh, I'll leave it below. Make sure you go check out her channel, because I love watching her videos. So I won, she recently did a giveaway for like, she like decided she wanted to get rid of some books. And so she put like different categories together and she decided to, ev one person like would win every box, you know what I mean? So I won the, I think, I don't remember what she titled the box, but I just won a box with two books. And those books are Boy Meets Boy by David Leviathan, which I'm excited about because... I have books, I have one of his books, which is Every Day, which I loved, and then I have Will Grayson, Will Grayson, which is by him and John Green, which I also loved, so I'm excited to read another one of his books. Um, just, I'm a little disappointed about the condition, a little bit, because I mean, when I, when I, when I saw it, it looked fine, but there's kind of like a crease back here, and then there's some writing in the book. And I'm not too excited about that, so I might just read this and then give it to my local used bookstore because I'm not too excited about this copy, but I'm excited to have it, so that's cool. And then inside was the note she wrote. Oh, okay, so her YouTube channel is on here, The Library of Sarah. I think that's her YouTube channel, so check out The Library of Sarah. 
And then I got one other book, which is in way more better condition. I, I'm excited about this one. It doesn't even look like it's been read before. It's called Tell Us We're Home by Marina Budos. When she showed this book, I had no idea what it was about. So I didn't, I didn't even enter the giveaway for this book. I actually entered the giveaway for this book because I wanted it that bad. So, but this one looks interesting and it, um, it's in like perfect condition. So I'm excited to check it out. I have no clue what it's about. I haven't even read the back yet. I should have read it at the back before I did this video, but I'll leave it in the link below so you guys can go check it out for yourselves. But yeah, pretty cover. I like the color and it's in good condition. So yeah, that is another addition to my email box. Um, I might add on tomorrow if I get anything in the mail tomorrow, but if not, then this is the last edition, and thanks for watching. Bye.